Hey everybody, it's Jennifer from Gentle Soaps and today I'm going to be making something new. I'm going to be foraging near and far. So we're going to the ocean, we're going to get some seaweed, fresh, fresh seaweed. We're going to be drying it for this newest concoction of mine, which I have entitled the Salish Sea. lights up and uh, it's kind of hard to do that sometimes. Some old, old, old rotten seaweed. Yeah. Most of our beaches are pebble beaches. This is Willows Beach so it's super pretty, super smooth. Here's some bull kelp and some other kinds of kelp. Uh, most of this is rotten. Just wash up on the beach. You don't want to eat that. Look at this stuff on. See, I told you I have dancer feet. And there's a Canada goose that's come to say hello. Hello, eh? <laughs> it's beautiful. Beautiful duck. Beautiful goose. Beautiful goose. Hello, hop, hop. We just had baby ducks today, so we're really excited. Oh, I'm gonna watch my feet. There's some, some beach sand, beach, beach glass here. All right, here's our clean beach. It's a great place to come and swim. You come to Vancouver Island, and about a mile from my house. Ocean water. We're gonna clean this. 
and make some salt. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> I can get any. <laughs> this is super funny. Okay. Tide's coming in. Work with me. Okay, I got half a gallon. Gallon dish. Okay. Oh. Oh. Is that your shots of those guys. So pretty and so cute just tucked in here. The mussels, the barnacles, and anemones. I love living on an ocean guys. Creatures of the Salish Sea. Okay so here's our harvest. We've got the red seaweed on the left green on the right with the feathery stuff in the middle here. This might just be, I'm not a huge, this might just be immature this. <laughs> I don't know, I think so. It's the same color but it just has a different shape so I don't think it is. Some of them might be. That one is. I'll have to any seaweed professionals out there who know what each of these things are, I will do my best to label them in the description or here on the, on the, in this segment. But here is the fun thing. In amongst is our little aquarium. So these guys are going back. <laughs> see the, see the chandelier in there? See if I can shoot it so you can just see all the little creatures. Let's see if I can get them to move a little. guy and another little guy. It's like my own little tide pool here. I think we can have some salt water so we can take them back tomorrow. So I'm going to put them in the cold where they can stay nice and cool like the ocean. And then I'll go dump them back in the sea. Look at that. They look like spiders. I'm not even sure. I thought they were I know there's a lot of um, sea snails in there. There might be some hermity crabby things. I'm just surprised there weren't any. Oh, there's some really big, like, bug-like things. You guys gotta check this out. Where are you hiding? Where is he? He's giant. There's a little one down there. There he is. Do you see him? His little antennas are right at the top here. Look at him! Look at that guy! What is that? It looks like a roly poly bug, but it's an ocean creature. I hope he makes it. There's a couple of them in this batch. Anyway, they were living in amongst these little tinies. So I guess they're baby bugs that are going to grow into big old sea creatures. I hope. Or they'll be food for fishes. But very cool. Fun at the beach. There's our booty. There's our bounty. Hey, now we're just drying everything at 170 degrees. 